Hey everyone, it's Nell from the Mommy Blog, and let's see if this works. It is Pintober Day 16, and you can see my flash. We, me and Analia, she actually hasn't officially helped me in the kitchen before, so this should be pretty exciting for her. Um, we are going to make three ingredients, no bake peanut butter oat square. Doesn't that look yummy, mama? So this recipe is from Cookies and Cups. Um, one cup peanut butter, half cup of honey, and three cups rolled oats. <laughs> I'm asking her, are you going to help me mix this? And she's like, I don't know. You're eating some bread? Yeah? Yeah. She helped me clean the counter. So we have our peanut butter, creamy peanut butter. Um, dollar fifty on clearance, some mom's best uh, quick oats, and we are going to add in, uh, we, I put leftover cereal um, in baggies so that the girls can have snacks like throughout the week or whatever. So we have some granola and I don't know what these are. And the um, uh, chocolate that I got in clearance last year, you can check out my other video. Which one was it? Uh... Uh, oh, the muffin video. I used, I'll put a link here somewhere. I used these ones, and the, that's half of the leftover. Squeeze it real hard. Mm. And I forgot to show you all the honey, but it's a half a cup of honey and uh, one cup of peanut butter. So we still need to put another cup in here. And the instructions call to microwave or uh, heat it up and mix it all together on the stove top, but we'll go ahead and do the microwave. Oh, it was bubbly as I took it, well, as I was taking it out of the microwave. Careful, it's hot, okay? Uh, and yeah, be careful because it is hot. Do you think we need to? Oh, you want to stir it? Okay. Oh, that side really isn't too hot. I think we need to heat it up a little bit more. Yes, don't put it in your mouth. Oh, okay, we're just adding in the oats now since I'm using half a cup of uh, measurement thingy. That is six cups, but I think we're just gonna do five since we have the chocolate chips and stuff to add. How many is that? One, two, three, four, five. I think that's five. Oops, <laughs> mommy was in counting. Analia really wants to eat it already. We have to stir it. Keep stirring. Could have broken some of them up that way, you know, kind of evenly distributed. So I already have my, um, I don't know what size this is, but sprayed with nonstick spray. We're just gonna put it in here. Well, I'm gonna use like a small <coughs> rolling pin. Cover your mouth to kind of smooth everything out, and then we will show y'all what it looks like if somebody doesn't eat it all. Is it yummy? No, it's done. Yummy? <laughs> so we kind of rolled it out. I, I mean, I could roll it out a little bit thinner. Um, see the the chocolate chips melting, and yeah, we just ended up using our hands. You wanna push it, Mama? Cause uh, it's not as sticky as you would think it would be. And so place in refrigerator until set and cut into squares. You ready to go? Okay, so it's time to go pick up Eliada. Oh, it's kind of off centered here, but um, we have it in our fridge because our fridge is full of farmer's market goodies and stuff. Um, and it should be ready when we get back. Tell me what y'all think. I uh, cut off the edges and that's what we have here on this plate and then I'm just gonna take and I already cut these in strips I got your milk right there and then I'm just gonna you know cut them in squares here what do y'all think what it, does it taste like a granola bar oh yeah it has honey peanut butter and chocolate it's not pink milk it's white milk it's just a color changing cup yeah there you go the girls can take them for snack time or lunch sound good yeah? Or how'd they come out? Let me try one. Mmm. Okay. Mmm. It's falling apart. <laughs> it's falling apart. Yeah, these were just the edges. So these are a little bit more crumbly. Mm -hmm. All 
All right, so I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I'm definitely glad we added, or I added that cereal in the end. It gave it an extra crunch. Um, and I bagged about four or five of these three in a row. I didn't count how many it made, but I guess you could leave them uh, long, but I just cut them to kind of make them or leave less of a mess. And speaking of mess, I gotta wash dishes now. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Like, comment if you have ever made any granola bars yourself. Um, I definitely like to check out that video if you have one. Um, subscribe if you haven't already. We have uh, the rest of this week is going to be all recipe. We will see y'all in the next video. Bye.